Good morning, my friends. I hope all of you are having an awesome, fantastic day. And hello from Icy Straight Point here in Alaska. Look at this view that we got to wake up to this morning. Absolutely beautiful. Now today, we were supposed to go to Skagway, but because of the recent rock slides, apparently there's a big rock that could drop at any moment, and that's right above the pier where the ships dock. So World Caribbean sent out an email about a month ago saying we were coming here instead, which we are just fine with. We do have a fun shore excursion plan today. We have a kayaking adventure. This is a small dock. I think we are the only ship here today. But let's not waste any more time. We need to head downstairs, get coffee. I hope you guys are ready because we are. Let's go do this. It's coffee time. We have made it off of the ship and it is freezing. I definitely think today has been the coldest day thus far. Ooh, I spoke too soon. Looks like another cruise ship is pulling up right now. Well, dang, there's another cruise ship on this side also, but they have to tender over. This view is just absolutely breathtaking. I feel like I'm in a movie. I feel like I'm looking at a piece of art. Surreal. They do offer a golf cart if you need extra assistance, but we are going to finish walking over this bridge and head through the Adventure Center. Okay, we have about a five minute walk over to the Kayaking Adventure Center. We get to take the scenic route. I just cannot get over this view. It's There's snow-capped mountains up there. It's very foggy. Incredible. Oh yeah. This is nice. Yay, we made it to the Kayak Center. That was about a five minute walk. We are all checked in. Our tour guide said we have about 10 more minutes until we even start to get ready. So we're just walking around, taking in some more views. By the way, I did not book this shore excursion through World Caribbean. I actually booked it through TripAdvisor and I was able to save just about $160. And I was able to put that money towards our junior suite. So that's my biggest tip for any of you who are planning on coming to do an Alaskan cruise, try to book your shore excursions through the third parties. Yes, it is a lot easier to just book through your cruise line, but cruise lines tend to overprice their shore excursions. So I was able to save quite a bit of money. I really like this port so far. It's very small, it's very quiet, and it's very cute. I like it a lot. Are you excited? I'm beyond excited. Like this is something that we never do. No. So I'm thrilled <laughs> <laughs> and a little scared. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully we see a whale or an otter. Or an otter. Just would wildlife cool. would be really cool to see. Well, we were pointed in the wrong direction by three people. They told us our excursion was over here at the Kayaking Adventure Center. And we are using a different company. So we are actually supposed to meet our tour guide over by the gondolas. I think we... We'll be good. I did call just to let them know. They said it happens all the time. Don't worry, we will wait for you. So thank goodness. We are inside of the van now, just waiting to be brought over to our spot to start kayaking. We know also together with Haynes has one of the densest populations of bald eagles. So keep your eyes out. I'm sure you will see a lot today. And they are out in any weather. What about sea otters? Yes, and they're uh, very, very adorable and cute, and they come right to your kayak. Oh, really? oh no way. Yeah. Uh -huh. oh, For some that. reason, they're very friendly yeah. here. <laughs> <laughs> now, you said a gallon of milk is $17. Yes. What about a carton of eggs? Um, well, I've been trying to find eggs on the island for about a week now. Oh, um, no right way. now, um, I want to say maybe $10. Wow. 
lot of people, what they do is they do Instacart in Juno and then uh -huh. they fly it over. So it's a little bit they cheaper and you have a cost. <laughs> like, That's nuts. Yeah, but it's, I mean, it's, it's quite different. <laughs> we made it. It was very easy to get here. This tour company is very nice. Yeah. Make sure you, because we might, in your case, want to move them up to where you're not. Um, Let's see. Yeah. Make sure you're comfy. Oh yeah, not too bad. Yeah. And you're just touching the end, right? Yes, sir. Okay, cool. So you're set. This should work. Yeah. I like how they have waters for us. Yes. Yeah, those are. Thank you. It. Those complimentary. And away we go. I'm set. I'm packed in here. I'm ready. It is starting to rain just a little bit. We're off. We're in the water. There's one of their cemeteries. In order to get there, you have to take a boat over. And our tour guide just said there's brown bears that are known to walk around right here. Again, just look at this. Look at the snow-capped mountains. Oh, oh beautiful. Goodness. This is so cool. We have seen a few eagles. There's one right over there. Look at that crab. <laughs> it's huge. Do it, babe. Yeah, it sounds right there. Yeah, right there. Don't go past that first line. There you go. Hey, you got it, babe. There you go. Look at that. He's heavy. He looks delicious. He's like, I'm ready to eat. Watch your sound, though. The veggie nice crab. Look at this. You get bit by a king crab. I always laugh because they're super slow. Wow. Yeah, this is so cool. But uh, the dungeons are really fast and they can get you and they're mean. And they're, they, they'll drop blood and they can hit you pretty good. Yikes. I'm going to kiss the crab. I can't believe you did that. <laughs> we spotted two brown bears right there. They're moving. There's one of the brown bears right there. There's a seaplane passing by. I am exhausted. This has been a workout. You good back there, babe? Great. We're almost back now. There's two eagles right there. We made it back on land. That was so much fun. We got to see a lot. We got to see those bald eagles right there at the end. My legs don't want to work just yet because we were out there on the water for just about three hours. Ton of fun. It was worth it. I'm so happy we were able to do this as a shore excursion today. I'm also very happy that I brought the drive bag today because it was needed. All right, we were just dropped back off here at the port. I did want to mention all of the shore excursions, they take place in Huna and it's walkable, but if you book a shore excursion, more than likely they will offer transportation to get you to and from. But if you don't book a shore excursion, you can walk it like these folks are doing. And then they have a little beachfront right here as well.
they do have gondolas here. They are free. There they are right there. I don't think we are going to do it this time. We are just way too cold and wet. This feels so incredibly good. Wow. Yeah. My hands are, so cold. I was gonna say my hands are numb. Yeah. Just made it back up to the room trying to warm up, but we have our second towel animal. Made it back to the room after having a late lunch inside of Windjammer, and I just wanna be honest and transparent real quick. The food inside of Windjammer, at least for lunch, has not been good. Yeah. The quality has been pretty poor and- It's been the same repetitive food I know. every single day. They do not switch it up. Like what's going on? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. We've been talking with a few other passengers and they've been saying the same thing, that yeah. the food has been lacking. Breakfast inside of the wind jammer, eh, it's been okay. Could yeah. could be better, but it's definitely better than lunch. We haven't been to wind jammer for dinner, so yeah, maybe we, should we don't try know. That. Yeah, maybe. Maybe dinner can change our opinion. <laughs> I hope so. But, like, last night I got the Surf and Turf from Chops inside of the main dining room. That was good. That was delicious. Coastal Kitchen has been good. Mm -hmm. I kind of feel like they just want you to book the specialty restaurants, Absolutely. which, that's fine. We, we like going to the specialty restaurants, but, you know, the included food could be better. Yeah, I mean, we shouldn't always have to opt for that either. Or Sorrento's, I mean... I know, but how much Sorrentos. pizza can you eat? It's not sustainable to always eat pizza. We need our, you know, Very true. healthy fats, but our protein, Sorrentos is a carbs. great late night snack, let me tell yeah. you. What did you think of the kayaking adventure this morning? Oh my gosh, it was incredible, you guys. Yeah. It was beautiful, the views. Was I just kept time. thinking, wow, like, this is something I thought I would never do. Yeah. <laughs> so, it was incredible. I highly recommend I recommend doing too. that. <laughs> and the company was great mm -hmm. they waited for us they explained everything to yeah. us they were just very kind and they said you know this happens all the time i do wish someone from the company was kind of standing there with a yes. sign because there are it's other confusing. companies yeah so just follow the sign that says excursion hub not the signs that say kayaking adventure this way that's the yeah. that's a different company i recommend it i'll be sure to leave their link down in the description if you want to check out this shore excursion on your next Alaskan cruise if you're coming here to icy straight point, but for now Cruise nap. It's time for a cruise nap. Let's do it <laughs> That was a phenomenal cruise nap looks like they are getting ready to untie us as we head back out to sea I just cannot get over this view. I mean, do you guys see this? It looks like a movie, but this is real life It was a great day. It is still raining though we can't really see anything over this way. Just be prepared if you are coming here. Bring your umbrellas, bring your raincoats, ponchos, rain shoes, and you will be just fine. I really enjoyed this port. I wish we did have more time. We were going to do a little bit more today, but this morning just wore us out as we were doing our kayaking adventure. Plus the rain, we were freezing, we were wet. It's all good. We will be back. We just love this Alaskan cruise so much. We have already told each other, let's do this again next year. We did go ahead and fill out this form to have our breakfast delivered right to our room in the morning. We chose to have it delivered between 8 a.m. and 8.30. We filled out our stateroom number and the number of guests. Now this is included, at least the continental breakfast portion of it. There's a good amount of stuff that you can have delivered. And then you have the option to order hot food for the American breakfast. If you want to order hot food, you do have to pay $7.95. Still pretty good just to have that convenience. And then, of course, you do have to leave a tip. But we love doing this, especially on sea days. Now we are just going to put this on our door. And it should be picked up overnight. And then our breakfast will be delivered in the morning. So that's how they do it. Huh. And we're off. Until next time, Icy Straight Point. It was a fun day. We made a lot of memories. Also, I highly recommend purchase yourself a pair of binoculars. I bought ours off Amazon. I just bought a compact pair for us. But these are a must because you never know what you could see with these.
I think that's a sea lion. Oh yeah, there's look! Two of them. There's two of them. <laughs> this is worth the price of a balcony right here. And you notice the birds kind of going in one area. Yeah. And they're like, oh, there has to be a whale or some type of marine life. Maybe there is a whale somewhere. I set up the GoPro to hopefully get an awesome time lapse of us heading back out to sea. I wanted to pull out the camera to let you guys know a few fun facts that we did learn today on our little tour adventure, yeah. like a gallon of milk, $17 on that island. That's insane. And you can have food Instacarted from Juno by a, a seaplane. Sea <laughs> I wonder how funny? much that would cost. Holy cow. And then we also learned it rains 300 days. Out of the year. And then when the sun is out, our tour guide said, all of the residents, they stay outside all Aww. day long because, you know, they don't really get to see the sun like we do. But we're looking out of our balcony right now and the views are just... Panoramic. It's absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. We've seen humpback whales, sea lions. Yeah. It's so beautiful. And it's like, just going to get better I know. and better. I was getting a little misty eyed. Just Same. I couldn't believe that this is on our planet. It's just so beautiful, these mountains. I've never seen snow-capped mountains before, so... We still have a few more days to go, but I can already tell you guys, do an Alaskan cruise yes. at least once in your life. You will not be disappointed. And get a veranda. Yeah. You cannot do a Save some money, cruise without getting a veranda. Budget and get a veranda, a balcony, see, a suite. It's worth it. You'll see wildlife without doing excursions. Just from your room. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go eat. I think we are going to... We're going to try Windjammer. This we is Bianca's ourselves. idea. <laughs> Well, let's try it for dinner. Yeah. Because we haven't tried what is it? For Italian dinner. night? Italian night. So we'll see. Wish us luck. <laughs> also, babe, what all did we see today out on the water while we were kayaking? Well, we Besides saw, the crab. <laughs> we saw some crabs. We saw the bears. And we saw oh, the dolphins. Alaskan porpoises, which yep. is like their dolphins, smaller dolphins. Right, and then we did see a well blow air, yes. but it was pretty far away. And then we saw so many eagles. Yeah, we did. <laughs> they're so cute. They're like little lovebirds because they're, they're always paired. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they're so cute. Speaking of a seaplane, I wonder who Instacarted. <laughs> <laughs> washi washi. I love it. Thank you. Nice. They have the Italian flags out. What do we have? Italian style meatballs, lasagna. I don't know what that is. Fresh fruit. And then there's more over here. Eggplant, grilled peppers, grilled zucchini, chicken parmesan, garlic bread. They have more pasta options. For once, we actually got lucky and found a really good table right next to a window. Happy Thursday. This is one thing that I love about World Caribbean. Every time you enter any elevator, you always know what day of the week it is. Back in the schooner bar, tonight's drink choice for myself, cranberry and vodka. I think this could potentially be our next Royal Caribbean cruise on Icon of the Seas next year, 2024. I mean, every single time we come back to our stateroom and we come outside on our balcony, the view just keeps getting better and better. This is absolutely breathtaking. I have never seen nature or the world like I'm seeing it right now. My goodness. Book an Alaskan cruise right now. <laughs> I agree. This should tell you everything that you need to know. So, Italian night at Windjammer. It was okay. It was a little bit of a step 
above what we've been having for lunch. I just think the food quality is off. It's not that good, but they did have more options. So we may do. It, it was okay, but I do recommend if you can pre-book the specialty dining before your cruise like Chops and Izumi. I just feel like that's where World Caribbean is strong when it comes to food, not in their buffet inside of the wind jammer. something that we have been enjoying we will turn on our tv because there's a channel where there's a camera at the front of the ship and i mean look at the view it speaks for itself and i wanted to point out the current time 9 30 p.m and this is what it's looking like let's do the burger okay we're gonna do the royal burger as well and then the chocolate cake and then <laughs> order of the chocolate cake and the chocolate chip cookies. Yes. Yeah, we are going to stay in tonight. We do not want to miss any of these breathtaking views. Again, they just keep getting better and better. The water is so calm right now. This is what we paid for right here. We did order room service. So we are waiting for that to be delivered. I think we are just going to sit out on our balcony, enjoy each other's company, enjoy the views, the weather, the crisp air. I'm gonna call it an early evening. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up as it really does help out the channel in so many different ways. I love you guys so much. Please remember, it's nice to be nice in YouTube. I'll see you in the next video. Prince Charming, out. I had to show you that our room service did arrive. It looks good and it smells good. Look at those chicken wings, heck. Yes. Ooh, look at Bianca's peanut butter and jelly. I got a Cobb salad, and then we are going to share the Royal Burger.